I'm Terry Fadum. I'm a manager of corporate alliances over the School of Medicine, Perlman School of Medicine, University of Pennsylvania. I think companies that listen, and listening is institutionalized within a company, it's not individualized. Um, people at the ground level can listen. If it's listening isn't part of the value uh, structure of that company, they're not going to be good at co creating. We have a, a, a clinical study going on now for a drug to treat neuroblastoma in children and young adults that was a direct result of a company, Pfizer, listening to scientists at the University of Pennsylvania, clinicians, who had an idea for the use of a drug which was made for a completely different purpose. And um, a lot of interaction, discussion around what patients' needs were, a hypothetical discussion about what it could do for these patients. There is no effective therapy, and this drug is now in clinical trials. And um, without giving away too much, which I can't, it, it is uh, showing uh, signs of being very effective. Well, companies have to make them up on their own. I mean, there's no, you know, you don't go to the store to buy the uh, co-creating toolkit, although it would be kind of nice if we had one, right? So um, I think that all the tools are there that companies have. And they've got strategic planning. They've got listening to customers. They've got, and every company's got its own culture and their own way of approaching their problems and getting them solved. And it's putting, it's matching that uh, behavior with a partner that is willing to work with them. And that's where, it's, that's where it always comes down. Not every company can work with every partner. And that's another thing that companies always don't recognize. Pick them, pick your partners, work with them for a very long period of time. It establishes all those things that people value.